<laughs> 104.7 The Cave, Mike the Intern in the studio with my best friends in the whole world, the Springfield Regional Arts Council. This Friday is First Friday Art Walk, and it's looking like great weather, too. Yeah, it's going to be gorgeous. We're so excited. I know. Thank God it rained now instead of on Friday when we're yeah. out trying to check out art for free downtown Springfield. Right. So start off at the Creamery, as always. As always, we are the early bird location. We'll be open from 5 to 7. Um, we have a jazz tuba player Ooh, nice! named Ralph Heppla. He's amazing. Yeah, he is good. He's going to set the mood. Um, and then we have a really cool show called Landscapes in Peril. We've got everything from interesting melted art to gorgeous landscapes of the Ozarks. So it should be a pretty broad That's show. That's a huge spectrum. It's yeah. really, really cool. <laughs> yeah, we wanted we wanted artists to show us their perspective on like what what the environment is like right now. Yeah, okay, so. I mean, as, as the Ozarks, we are big believers in getting out into the environment yep. and enjoying the landscape that you're in. I just in went floating hiking. this weekend. Exactly, yeah. you know, and as people that are out in the world a lot, you know, artists see that and mm-hmm. can see the change over their lives. And we are really fortunate to have members that are elementary students as well as, you know, 90-year-olds. So being able to kind of yeah. portray that change has been really exciting for us. It's good to see. Um, and you mentioned jazz. I'll be over at the Galois. Uh, they've got Jazz Fest all this weekend, and that's yeah, free on Friday. kicking off on Friday. Yeah, kicking so they'll Friday. be out there, too. Um, and there's some any, any other venues people need to check out? Well, I mean, you mentioned the Galois. The Galois hasn't been open for First Friday in a long time. Yeah, so it's, a big This deal. is the first month yeah. it's been open for a long time, so that's really exciting that we've got them back. Super exciting. And then uh, Bookmarks, as always, has a really great show um, called Dream With Their Eyes Wide Open. Um, Peter Crookshanks. Yes, who is a great artist. We've had him at the Creamery before, and you yeah. probably also met him over at Arrow Reuse. Arrow Reuse, um, yeah. He's a great add to that event space regularly, so that should be fun. Um, and then the last one we kind of want to hit on is the um, Obelisk Home Show. This is their 18th annual birdhouse auction benefiting Habitat for Humanity. Oh, cool. mm-hmm. um, so they've got um, the opening of their gallery Ozarks, and then they're going to be auctioning off these birdhouses for Habitat, which is pretty awesome. Yeah. It's always really cool because they have local artists decorate these birdhouses. They all have the same birdhouse to start. And just seeing like the range of different styles mm-hmm. is insane. Uh, they had a really cool Totoro one there last year. Um, I personally have bought one that looks like a giant ball of yarn that's so cool. it, it was really weird with you, <laughs> yeah, for sure. yeah. It, awesome. had, it had a little like sculpted cat it was adorable <laughs> that's um, definitely tracks. but there's there's something there for everybody and the bidding kicks off tonight but i think it goes through the end of the month right yeah so you have plenty of options to go and check out the gallery space um and as well as just all the really cool stuff that they have over there yeah a lot of stuff and the best part is it's all free so if you're looking for something yeah. to do tonight uh the ladies thank you for giving us a million reasons to do it but again it's free downtown start at the creamery first friday art walk ladies thanks for coming in this morning thanks, thanks for having, having us, us.